Yeah, so uh, it appears that restaurants in San Francisco yep. are adding a charge Correct. when it comes to the bottomless mimosa brancha. Yes. Uh, and what is that charge about? Well, they're sick and tired of people getting hammered and then getting sick in their restaurants. So <laughs> now there will be a fee for those that are overserved. They'll now be adding a cleanup fee to your bill if you vomit oh, at the restaurant. Um, so it happens enough. Uh, yes. When the basics are brunching. Correct. Hashtag <laughs> brunch all day. If you don't like brunch, uh, I can't be friends with you. I don't uh, trust really? you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> get, really? Really? <laughs> yeah. Hashtag, hashtag brunch goals. Uh. Mm-hmm. No one knew so, what brunch was five years ago. I t- <laughs> no, what That's are you talking true. about? I've been eating brunch I'm, all my life. I know. I'm no, always I'm so, we all know. I, I, I'm... I'm making a joke about now everywhere you go, it's like all about the brunch. But five years ago, people could care less about brunch. Yeah, in Southie, legitimately. <laughs> yeah, a, no, I don't believe now that. Now it's a, now Mickey brunch is, is a like thousand the, percent right. It's like the new nightclub. Yep. Uh, going to brunch. like uh, In Southie, all of a sudden, about five, six years ago, right. every place was open for brunch. Right. There was a line out the door. Right. When I moved there, there was none of that. Right. It is sanctioned boozing in the morning. That's I mean, what it's become. I mean, IHOP has been serving brunch forever. I didn't see people, you know, putting on their best attire. <laughs> IHOP <laughs> is not brunch, you dingbat. Putting on their best Sunday attire it's and not, going there and eating. No, no, it's Stop not. Stop it. No, it's such brunch, a, no, It is the biggest look at me now. It is not look yes, at me now. It is. It's people Stop having it, fun. Cor- no, it is. It's a club. People want, people want to make their Sundays better. Yeah, no, it's <laughs> not. It's a look at me now. Uh, no, it's not. The yes, best thing is. in the world is being able no. to have both lunch Stop and breakfast at the same time. Time. It is a look at me now because mm. it, it wasn't as big. Everywhere you got now, everybody's got a brunch. That is true. Courtney came in. She's like, I brunched at the rivers or something this past week. I brunched. Yeah. I brunched so hard. Uh. <laughs> right. Exactly. Um, <laughs> but people are. There's that many people that are getting overserved and getting sick at the restaurant. They, maybe yeah. They, maybe they ought to cut people off, but you can't because it's bottomless. Bottomless, mimosas. and so the prices depending on the restaurant vary between twenty five bucks and a hundred bucks for the cleanup fee. Uh, but uh, you know what? If you're getting so hammered that you're throwing up at a restaurant, yeah, you should be held financially mm-hmm. responsible for that. Uh, texter says, please tell Curtis that bottomless mimosas doesn't mean he can go without pants. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a good point. Always wear my pants. <laughs> Try to every day anyway. Who the hell drinks orange juice and champagne anyways? A lot it of sounds people do. Disgusting. Wiggy, I do. Wiggy, I love you today. It you sounds so right. like so stupid and disgusting. And acidic. Right. Like who the hell is like uh, oh you know you know what would really, really go great with my French toast and my home fries mm. is is champagne and orange juice yep. mixed together. Vitamin C what and What jackass alcohol. came Same up with time. that idea? Hey, you, you people are morons. Uh, this text is so right. That is the most San Francisco thing I've ever heard. Charge a 300% markup on the alcohol, overserve them, and then they have to pay, <laughs> they have to, pay to clean up when they get sick. How many mimosas would you guess that you have to have to get ill? I would think you'd have to drink a <laughs> lot of champagne, right? It is bottomless. Yeah, though, and what... champagne sometimes goes directly to people's head. I don't like champagne. Champagne, to yeah. me, makes me feel I'm sick. I'm such so. a champagne guy. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> st- said no one ever. I did. I just said it. Stop it. You Stop. really like the flavor? Yes, Stop I love it. it. Oh, I, I love it. I'm a raging alcoholic, and I hate Stop. I love champagne. champagne. No one I love ever Prosecco. drinks I love champagne. All of them. Like, oh, they're delightful. Oh uh, my god! And for my during uh, during that period where we had to stay indoors for like two years, on my birthday, literally sat out at a pool and just drank like two bottles of prosecco. Oh my oh, god! How hungover were you? Uh, not uh, really hungover. Do you ever have an extra glass of Corbell and get a little woozy <laughs> while you're Pokemon going? Definitely don't get woozy, oh but god. I definitely do uh, drink some champagne and play some Pokemon Go. I would what never... is the best brunch entree? Ooh. I believe it to be Eggs Benedict. I've said that a million times. There is nothing better at brunch than Eggs Benedict. I like a breakfast pizza. Ew! Gross. What? Pizza. Said no Those one ever. Gross. They're Horrible delicious. Taste. Stop yeah. it with the brunch. You're so basic. Brunch I'm is- not basic. You Eggs Benedict what? and I'm the basic one? Do we? First of all, no basics are ordering Eggs Benedict. They're going to order like a frittata. Can I, I have love the a veg- good stuff? Can I have French the vegetable toast. frittata? Were you were you really worried when you first ordered a frittata because you thought you didn't have to pay for it? <laughs> <laughs> can you make the Can you make the frittata with just egg whites? <laughs> I I just think that if you're going to sit down and eat brunch, you want to eat something that is filling, and that is the Eggs Benedict. Now, 
Sometimes they give you the two. I mm-hmm. only eat one and a half. I like I leave a half of one of the eggs Benedict English muffins on my plate. So uh, for dietary purposes. Yeah. Yeah, totally. I, I, I just got a text from a buddy of mine uh, who still goes out into the world. I don't. He says girls dress to the nines in Southie oh, to God. go with their girlfriends to brunch on Sundays, but dress in sweatpants when they go out Friday night. Why? Right. They do. They, it, is, it is. It is. It has become probably the best. Would you say it's the best activity of the weekend? It's the dumbest Brunch. thing ever. No, it's but it's overpriced. What, it's, oh God! It's it, like more than a night. The, the, like this can be ask a boomer, but more than a night out. Mm-hmm. I would you much and rather your, you and your friends. You guys go to brunch every weekend. Yeah. when you can. Yeah, I would. I would rather get drinks at brunch than stay out late. Brunch is so stupid. Why, Why? are we even talking about brunch? Why is it stupid? You could dumb- watch the game. Let me, what do you get at brunch? What, like me personally? Yes. Usually an avocado toast, maybe a side of French fries. <laughs> it's the <laughs> dumbest thing ever. If you want breakfast, just eat breakfast. Don't go to some place. Right. If you want lunch, eat lunch. And if I'm watching a football game, I don't want breakfast. I want nachos or right. I want But that, that's the best part about brunch, the, Curtis, is you could you get, get that as well. Both. Something oh, for everyone. It's the oh, du- it's the it's look. The it's the most. Um, Why is it what's look the at me? Word like I don't for, understand like, prestigious, that. Prestigious, douchey, bougie. bougie. When nah. people go, I want to go to brunch. I literally would pay anything to slap that person back to reality. Do you want to know why I want to go to brunch? I want to go, I want to be able to order French toast, and then I want to be able to order... Freedom nice, toast! A, a, nice a roast lunch. beef sandwich. Yes, uh, exactly. Stop it! No, you some don't. Yes, I do! No, you no don't. Way. No, you don't. You know, when people Wait, go, how many times do I Instagram out that I'm no. at brunch? Uh, Never. When, when but I still go, like to go to brunch all go the time. To brunch, when people go to brunch... You have a burner uh, IG brunch account. When a people oh, go totally. to brunch, a large portion of them... End up ordering the breakfast type of stuff. The French toast, <laughs> yeah. pancakes. Yeah. Stop it with the, I want to have French toast, and then I'd like to order our roast beef well, sandwich. That's, I, the, oh, that's, that's the whole so point much. of brunch, like the brunch buffet. What? I, I, yes, also, there is not a chick them, alive right? that's going to order a roast beef sandwich. <laughs> right. You guys are a bunch of meanies, <laughs> Grinches. <laughs> no, um, it's not. Grinches. Yeah. That's exactly also, what they are, Courtney. Developing take. Eggs Benedict might be the most versatile entree that there is because uh, disagree. you can alter the protein. So therefore you could go with the Canadian bacon if you're, you know, if you're uh traditional Socialist. style, if you're uh, <laughs> you know. No, do you want to know what the, the You could go with the steak Benny. You could go with the lobster Benny. You could mm-hmm. go with the crab cake Benny. You could go with the prosciutto, Benny. Okay. It is probably the most versatile entree, entree uh, choice that there Said is. No, no you, want to, ever. you want to know what the actual most versatile is? Simple. It's chicken tenders, and here's why. Oh my God. You can put fried chicken over waffles, breakfast food. You can put them in a wrap, lunch food. You can put them with <laughs> country gravy or mashed potatoes and veggies, dinner food. Keep the mashed Boom. potatoes out your mouth. You can do a ch- you can do a uh, chicken finger sub. Right. I don't know about I don't know about gravy over chicken right. fingers. That just sounds. What are you well, a like? Fried Backwoods chicken. hillbilly. Right. What is this? <laughs> fried chicken. We should do are a brunch in a trailer. We should do a brunch event with the show. Oh, I love God. it. No thanks. I will boycott. It's the hot. It. It's the biggest douche move what ever. We, wait a minute. What if we did it? Mm-hmm. I have an idea. Okay. What if we did it for the Germany game, <gasps> which starts at. 9 a.m. here. Listen, oh, if, there's pretzels if I'm going to brunch, I, <laughs> if I'm we did a wa- we did a watch party. Yeah, if a I'm brunch, going, a, and we'll force you to enjoy brunch. No, if I, I we don't, will force you to be basic. I, listen, I go, but I just call it breakfast, and I get my <laughs> okay, French toast. That's fine. The, the whole this whole brunch thing is the dumbest thing <laughs> that people. Fine. It really is. It, it, it's it all really love is. it. There's it's, never been a brunch menu. I've been like, ooh, I'm happy it's brunch. I'm like, <laughs> damn, why can't I just have a normal meal? You're missing yes, out. Yes, yeah, yes, yes. it's the best menu. You are on. missing out. Uh, so where where's the best brunch? place to get brunch? Lincoln. <laughs> What about the corned beef? Bacon but Lincoln doesn't How even do you have its own about... menu. It's a regular menu, doesn't it? Isn't no. It? No, no. No, they it's Fruity Pebble Pancakes. Yeah, they have an unbelievable <laughs> brand, <laughs> brunch <laughs> menu over there. Also, Wiggy thinks it's a, n- a negative calling me basic. We've been over this no, time and time again. No, but that's what it is, That is me. You embrace that's it. What, like, in fact, five, five years, years ago, Fenway was Fenway that had great brunch, too. Five years ago. There was a place over by Fenway that used to have great brunch, too. Oh, Popeye's. Yes, exactly. Yeah, they serve McDonald's. Cheeky Monkey? Cheeky Monkey has a good brunch. 
<laughs> Cheeky monkey. Yeah. Yeah. Is that Frank Biden? To, I went to the place. There's not a single monkey in there. Right? <laughs> uh, you know what the best brunch is ever is when McDonald's has their breakfast menu McDo- running I love all McDonald's. day long. <laughs> it is the hot oh, like I I see people on IG like they're lining up to go out to places that have been there for 10 years and they never have gone there before. But you say, oh, come get a brunch and okay. pay. Hate what you don't, what you have I never know. experienced. I'm going to wait in line for an hour for Fruity Pebble Pancakes. <laughs> right. Have you ever had them? They're delicious. All right. Who's waiting in line for an hour just and, for And we also get the champagne waterfall. Uh, <laughs> Can I get a champagne flute? Oh, <laughs> uh, my God. You know what the greatest thing I've had at brunch? It is the cornflake pizza. Oh, <laughs> uh, my God. Me and the girls, we had an amazing time. Then we, didn't ha- we had champagne and apple juice. Wait a minute. Are we doing, I'm reminded of this. Are we doing the more basic than Courtney contest on the show? Oh, That's what we should do. I cannot wait. Yeah, I'm, I'm in. Okay. And correct to this 978 texter, brilliant, Coco Wiggy prefers legs and eggs. So if it was called legs and eggs, but it nope. was really brunch, right. then you'd love it. Nope, yes. I love booty and biscuits. Get it right, 978. <laughs> Nobody wants to have sticks, uh, chicken sticks and legs and eggs. I want booties and biscuits with some syrup. Uh, oh my was the God. place at Fenway Thornton's? Chime? No, it was Denny's. So. <laughs> I've eaten at a Denny's once or twice. Ah, Shime, I love brunch. You're such I a do. fraud. I'm not you're a fraud such a fraud. fraud. So, I what's the number one brunch. thing you get when you go to brunch? A hundred percent of the time, I will get like a stuffed French toast. Always. Ooh. So you basically get like breakfast. A, like but no, I also cheese, get like cream cheese, fruit stuff, like a strawberry, blueberry. It's compote. called a crepe. Yeah, oh, yeah. Hold a so I, I have a I have a system, especially if it's a brunch buffet. I have a system. Uh, okay. I go. I get either pancakes or a French toast if All they're right. offering it. Preferably French toast because okay. that's superior in every right. way. Yep. Uh, and start with French toast. Maybe some uh, some breakfast sausage. A right. little bit of eggs. Sounds Once like I finish that plate. I go back up, and I get a nice lunch plate. <laughs> <laughs> and there you go. Yeah. But that's, that's not why brunch. It's brunch. It's no, that's yes, breakfast. Wiggy. That's brunch. called fat people problems. <laughs> Ain't nobody going to a buffet to be like, all right, I'm gonna have French toast, some bacon, some home fries. Because at that same buffet, they'll have like the the, the prime rib, right? Or the, and then thirty oh, minutes you know, go later, up and get some of that. And then and... thirty minutes later, go, oh, I'm gonna go get some prime rib and, and some then I'm gonna go back potatoes. and maybe finish it off with like a chocolate chip muffin. But but if you don't have to go <laughs> back up and down, like if you're at Lincoln for the starter for the table, you can get like a buffalo chicken pizza and fruity pebble pancakes. Oh. And Who truffle the hell French is fries. Mixing that? A lot of people. Th- those are the best starters. No, there. those are morons. No. Who's mixing fruity pebble pancakes with a buffalo a little chicken sweet pe- can, I a little the way- can I get the huevos rancheros? Hold the rancheros, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you know what's amazing? I go to this new place in the seaport, and they make the best brunch ever. I get the stuffed French toast with cream cheese plus the General Gao's chicken. <laughs> it is spectacular. I do love both of those spectacular. things. Spectacular. If you could have both, why wouldn't you? The, those might be both in my top like Rushmore of foods. Wiggy, can I get the orange chicken with some orange juice, please? Oh, my God. And can you please sprinkle a little bit of champagne in there for me? I need a glass of Prosecco. Seco. Oh, hold on. Before you do that, let me take the perfect selfie. And let me get the foliage in the background. You see those leaves? Fruity see, pebbles. 781 text gets it. French toast and prime rib. So Best you waited six ever. hours in line to get French toast. I don't wait six hours could've in went, line. Hey, could have went to IHOP and got some great French toast I'm there. Telling you got the, people, prime rib. the people waiting in line in Southie are not ordering prime rib and French <laughs> toast. <laughs> They're coming okay. straight from Core Power Yoga, and they're getting <laughs> the one avocado slice toast. Of bread. They want the avocado. Yes, right. yes. Yeah. and the fruity pebble pancakes. Any chance you can uh, blend up the avocado toast and put it in a green smoothie? Ew! Can we get this moving? My blue bike yes. needs to be returned. I got to make sure my All gut right. health is feeling right. good. Anyway, I'm down with two. I, I'm down with two show ideas. One is that we should do a brunch. Maybe we'll do a foundation benefit brunch thing. All right. For that Patriots in Germany game. Bunker. (laughs) And then we have to do the more basic than Courtney competition. And we have to find that woman who is more basic than you. I don't know if she's out there, but she might be. And then you guys are going to, what, like test us? Would you rather? Yeah, we'll bring bring them in the studio. We have three contestants. Awesome. More basic than the most basic. Basic, basic just means one. I like fun things. <laughs> <laughs> That's really what it is. Live your truth, Sorry, Courtney. you're all miserable. <laughs> Don't let them bring you down. Is that what basic yes. means? Greg, I have an all alliteration ready. Yes. Boston's basic, 
Boston's basic bitch off. <laughs> that sounds good to me. All right, we'll be right back.